guide dogs. Laura prepares to cycle. I'm Laura Turner, I'm 31 and I'm from Atherston in Warwickshire. Cycling is actually quite a new sport to me. I've always liked the velodrome stuff and I thought, oh, maybe I could have a go at that one day. I'm doing regular spin classes at the gym. Really, really intense, definitely keeps you fit. Obviously just using the gym for various workouts, one-to-one -one sessions and just anything else I can get involved with that will up that fitness level. Laura cycles around the Olympic Park track on a tandem bike with her trainer. I'd like to have a go at more paracycling on track and do a little bit of a competition or, or something along those lines. That would be my aim right now. Laura is photographed with her guide dog inside the velodrome. I was sort of approaching my late 20s and I really wasn't getting out meeting family and friends like I should be. Even just doing trips to the supermarkets, I just didn't do it. I just had to push myself in the end and it was an emotional battle for me. Because I would, I'd let myself down with my white cane, I had to go through sort of habilitation for sort of like 12 months. So 12 months of working with my cane before they would actually put me on the um, waiting list for a guide dog. Laura's guide dog Hester sits in front of her. I've had Hester for three years now, just over three years. She's helped me a great deal. I couldn't thank guide dogs enough for the, you know, for the confidence boost, getting out and about, even just to come and to try a new sport like this. If it wasn't for Hester being by my side and being able to give me that confidence, I wouldn't want to be now looking to get on a train and get to the nearest velodrome. Outside the iconic velodrome, Laura and her trainer cycle past. guide dogs.